this delay percentage is misleading. I recently saw this post from the Ministry of Railways and I thought this was worth talking about. This post claims that Indian Railways has reached 80% punctuality with 10 divisions at over 95%. They claim that this figure is much better than several European countries. Now if you know trains in our country, you will know that something is going on here. To fully understand what's happening, let's use Germany as an example. In October 2025, Deutsche Bahn reported that 48.5% of long distance trains in Germany ran on time, while Indian Railways reported 80%. Though this figure is technically higher, that is a very misleading statement because both railways have different definitions of what it means to be on time. In Germany, Deutsche Bahn considers a train to be on time if it arrives and departs within 6 minutes of the scheduled timetable. The actual delay at each station is recorded and added into the statistics as well. Indian Railways on the other hand, considers a train to be on time if it arrives within 15 minutes of the scheduled arrival time. And most crucially, only the delay at the final destination of the train is considered. To see what this means in practice, I have taken a random sample train. This is the run of 22944 Indoor Junction Downed Express on December 22nd. We can see that at the final station, this train reached 2 minutes late. So, Indian Railways would see that it is less than 15 minutes and mark this train as being fully on time. If you are in Germany however, you have to consider the fact that this train gets delayed in the middle of the route. I punched the delay numbers as reported on NTES into Excel. As per the German standard, this train would be considered only 59.96% on time. And this is why 